Peggy 12. Captain! Who are you again? My name is Tintin. I'm a reporter. I first became aware of uh, Tintin when I had finished Raiders of the Lost Ark. So I had somebody go out and get me a book. It was in French, but it didn't matter. I understood the story Urge was telling. I remember visiting a, a friend of my mother's, and it was the first time I saw Tintin. Over the course of probably 10 or 12 years as I was growing up, I, I managed to collect every single Tintin book. The thing that a film and a game can bring is at least some aspects of new adventures. A movie is a story which is sort of set in stone. A video game changes constantly depending on the choices you make. It has that, that extra exploration quality to it and that and that slightly unpredictability. You are literally entering the world of that adventure and those characters. Working with Ubisoft has been terrific. It was important to us to find a creative team that were absolutely tuned in to Hergé's universe. We thought we'd let them show us a thing or two about how to design a game and how to honor a, a great artist like Hergé. We base the world of the game around the film, but it allows you to expand on the movie. I actually like the times that it takes you on new adventures that are not even part of our film. To me, that's a really great companion for a movie. The game, you know, allows the audience to assume the characters of Tintin, Captain Haddock and Snowy. The characters and environments are based on the, the digital characters that we created for the film. One of the keys to the adventures of Tintin is the fact that they are cooperative adventures. The game has very much been built around that, that philosophy. Each character's got their own abilities and skills that are unique to themselves, and you, you use those abilities to further the game and to help the other characters. So you'll be able to succeed when you feel the time is right to jump from Tintin to, let's say, Snowy, or leap from Snowy to Haddock. So often people think of video games as being a solitary thing that you do, and, and that's not the case at all. They can actually be a lot of fun for a, a family to play. We want the game to be as a higher standard as it can possibly be. We want it to live up to the film. You have to get out of here now! 